Greetings, it's me again. I'm sorry I got cut off there. A uh, bit of storage issues on my phone. Waylon, I was just saying about you, exercise, yeah? Um, baby steps. Just start going small, even if it's just 20 minutes walk every morning. Um, just getting to start getting into the habit. That's how I started. And even when I didn't feel like it, I went out and pushed through it. And that's really important. And then I was picking up, once I picked up the aerobic exercises, then I was starting on the sit-ups and push-up routine on a daily basis. And then I took up Krav Maga, which is a hobby, and that, that keeps my fitness. And, but I, I do train hard every day, and I go to the gym a couple of times. I'm not suggesting that everyone needs to do that or even would enjoy doing that. But I'm just saying some exercise every day, especially if it's in the daylight, vitamin D, it's doing you fantastic. And Waylon, I know you can do it. Look at diet. Look at a book called The China Study. You'll find it really interesting. Um, it's written by an American guy about nutrition. I've mentioned it before in my videos. Have a look at it. You don't need to go full hog at it, but you can take it up bits at a time. So um, give it a crack, man. But I'm just to let me, letting you know that uh, you're an inspiration and an example. And thank you for your, for, for your videos. And I, I believe, truly believe that anything you set your mind to, you will crack it. And that's what this journey is all about, guys. And um, Rockin' Roberta, your journey starting very shortly on Jack in the Suboxone. And um, I truly believe, again, that you can do it. You're a very organized, committed, beautiful lady. And I, I think that you've, you've got your supplements sorted now. You know what you're going to do. You've got your mindset correct. Get out there. Diet, exercise. I keep reiterating it. Get your meditation in. Spend some time, you know, look after yourself, basically, as you're going through it and minimize the withdrawal. And then the habits have to become a daily thing. They have the good choices have to become a daily thing, you know, and, and you have to push through any pain and negativity and try and keep a positive mindset. It's easier said than done, I know, but it is possible. If I can do it at 57 years old, an old lag like me, who, who has been an, an addict most of his adult life, uh, alcoholic and addict, then... I truly believe um, that anybody and all of you can do it who, you know, your inspiration is out there for all to see. So, but Roberta, I know you can do it. I'm right behind you, as are all of us. So, so guys, that's it from me. It's just, just sort of an update. And my next video will be when I've got, you know, something useful to say, um, which may be, t may be tomorrow. It might be a week. It might be two weeks, a month. Who knows? because um, I'm from Liverpool, so who knows what comes into my head. <laughs> All right, guys, so until uh, next time, um, as you know, I sign off the same every time with the old fist. Seize the day. Carpe diem. Seize the day. Don't forget that because it's so important to seize the day. Live life. Love life. Stay strong. If you're struggling, just hold on because it definitely, definitely will get better. So until next time, guys, much love to you all. Bye-bye.